In 2009, in Chicago at the Fermilab, one of the most important institutions in the world for the research on elementary particles, I met the physicist and Nobel Prize laureate Leon Lederman, and I discussed with him about the wonder and the marvel that inspired the greatest scientists and artists of all time. What's important to me is to, is to uh, convey the wonder of nature and the beauty. It's the beauty of nature. It's when we have a puzzle and we don't understand. We work at it, we work at it, and eventually, and whether it's uh, a day or a week or a month or a year, you're working at something and at some point you begin to understand it and then you are obsessed with its beauty that when we learn something about the world that we didn't know before it is almost always incredibly beautiful and see so that's that's the the art of nature is to have the excitement of being involved where you do something that you know you're in a new place you're seeing new things. It must be that way in art too, where some painter uh, suddenly does something on the canvas, steps back and looks at it and said, wow, you know, I had, uh, I, I made this. In nature, in science, you don't make it, somebody else made it, but you observe it and you suddenly begin to understand something that you didn't understand before. So, and that's, in, in our business, it's, it's connected very strongly to teaching. Because if you're teaching, you want to convey in the teaching of physics to students the incredible excitement of learning something totally new that, you know, you didn't know before, and now you understand it. And uh, how must it have been for Isaac Newton or Galileo, uh, or Einstein, to discover something. Einstein said for, about his own theory, he said, nobody who understands this can ever escape its magic.